Hey, Alex, welcome back. Um, just the thought of, of being back and obviously um, the calendar being what it is, uh, coming out of the pen versus being in that starting rotation. Yeah, it feels great to be back out there last night. Uh, actually contribute, uh, you know, anytime you're hurt or injured, uh, you, you kind of feel a separation from the team. Uh, and so to be back last night to throw well and feel healthy uh, was, was big for me. And uh, uh, obviously in a different role uh, than I planned on coming into the season, but uh, you know, that's kind of where we're at. Uh, when I came back, when I came back to the Dodgers, you know, I knew that there were, there were risks or whatever. And obviously with the pandemic presenting itself uh, and then obviously getting banged up early and, and missing three or four, four weeks, uh, the situation I came back to was not the same that I left and that's okay. Uh, you know, I knew that even during a regular season that that had a chance to happen, you know, that I could end up in the pen potentially, you know, I feel like I'm a good quality starter. I feel like I got a lot of uh, innings left uh, in the, in the starter role, but I came back to the Los Angeles Dodgers to win a world series uh, and to be back out there, feel healthy and feel good after what I've been through the last Last year, uh, I was, I'm excited and I'm excited about the stretch run and, and to get to the postseason. How do you think your stuff plays coming out of the pen? Dave is very, you know, said that you can obviously get guys out both left handed and right handed, see you for two, three innings just based on how much you're built up. Yeah, I'm good with, with whatever they need me to do. I, I feel good. Uh, my stuff is, feels good right now. Um, and so I'm excited. You know, I'm just ready to contribute whatever they need me to do. And uh, I'm just glad to be healthy and, and throwing the ball well. You posted a funny picture of you staring at a bunch of cardboard cutouts, and it was like it said something to the effect of "I'm paraphrasing," but being on the IL during the pandemic, what was that? What was that time like for you? And what was it about that photo that kind of symbolized what you were going through? I mean, just things are so weird right now. Even when you're playing and are, and are in the clubhouse, and when the guys are at home, me being around them and here at all the, all the games, you know, you still feel kind of a disconnect mm -hmm. more so than your typical clubhouse nature, just because the social distancing, like things just aren't the same as they are in any given normal year. Mm -hmm. uh, and so then adding being on top of the aisle on top of that, not traveling with the guys, like you just, you feel at arm's length, uh, you know, from, from your buddies. And so just to be back, be healthy, throwing uh, in the mix as, as much as I, as, as much as I can be uh, yesterday, uh, it feels good. It feels really good to be back. Um, arm slot, everything. Okay. Delivery, uh, no hesitation. 100%? 100%. Yeah, my, my stuff, uh, I felt like it was really good last night and hopefully I'll continue to build off of it. All right. Welcome back, Alex. Thanks for your time. Thanks. Questions from Dave Vassar. Go ahead, Dave. Hey, Alex. The conversations that you had with uh, Dave and Andrew about your role, was it determined because there wasn't enough time to build you up as a starter or what were the determining factors? Uh, I mean, I think you, you, you look at Tony, uh, you know, Tony's a hell of a pitcher. He's thrown, thrown great in, in a short time up here uh, this, this season. Uh, his stuff is, all, is off the charts and he's going to be a big part of the, of, the, of the future for the LA Dodgers. Uh, and so, uh, you know, you, you just have to support the, the decision that they made to go forward and, and keep him in the rotation. Uh, and, you know, me and Tony have become good friends uh, in, in my time here. Uh, he's a sponge, man, and he's got a really bright future. And so, uh, I'm excited for him and uh, just that's that's what they felt like the move they wanted to do going forward and so it's I just want to win a World Series so if, if that's how they want to move forward and that's how we're going to move forward. Have you thought about why your shoulder uh, started to get inflamed and was it do you feel like some of it was because of the shutdown and then the quick ramp up what do you what do you attribute it to? I don't know. I mean, it's, I mean, who, who knows, you, you know, obviously across the league, uh, the injury rate is pretty astronomical uh, as far as to what, what a, a normal season looks like um, to pinpoint any certain one thing. I mean, you drive yourself crazy trying to say, say that one certain thing caused guys to ha have a higher injury rate across the league. Um, but I haven't really gone down the rabbit hole to try and say, this is, this is why I think my shoulder started, started barking. Uh, I mean, was it frustrating? Abs absolutely. Especially, I mean, I, I mean, I have to imagine I stayed as pretty locked in and on top of stuff during the quarantine as, as anybody across the league. And so to have something crop up, like as soon as you start summer, summer camp was, was very frustrating, but you know, everything happens for a reason. So I feel good now and uh, I'm excited to contribute. And so, uh, you know, it just felt good to be back out there to be quite honest. Thank you. Next question is from Harry Castillo. Go ahead.
Alex, uh, did, did they communicate with you a sort of a specific role? A anything, a any specificities with, with what you'll be doing? Uh, yeah, we've, we've talked a little bit. You know, I think, uh, you know, they want to – they want to keep a little bit of length on me uh, early, just in case something something happens um, with any with any of our guys. But also, kind of the balancing act uh, of you know keep keeping my pitches up to a certain extent, but obviously contributing hopefully in some leverage situations uh, as we as we move forward and I earn their trust uh, with with each other. And um, at what point did you were you notified that you were going uh, to the bullpen? Because it seemed like you were revving up to to be a starter. To, you know, most of this this rehab. Oh God, when do we, I mean, a week ago, uh, a week and a half ago, maybe. Mm -hmm. uh, and, uh, I, I can't, I can't remember what, what, when exactly we, we sat down and had our initial conversation. And just, uh, you know, between that and then seeing Roscoe, um, sort of what was your reaction uh, when you heard about uh, Ross getting traded? Oh man. I mean, R Ross is one of my best friends uh, on the team in baseball. I mean, he's just a special human being. Uh, I, I think, uh, the way fans uh, took to him in L.A., uh, all the kind things that a lot of uh, guys in our clubhouse have already previously s stated about him the last two days. Uh, you know, you just can't say enough good things about Ross. Uh, I mean, he's a jack of all trades, super funny, super nice guy. I mean, he's all always there when, when you need him. Uh, you know, it's just words don't even do that guy justice. And so it's really sad that uh, he won't be a part of uh, this, this stretch run with us, but he's he's got a – really bright future with the Toronto Blue Jays. And uh, I think he'll do great there. And it's nice that he has some familiar faces, uh, but definitely sad to see, see my buddy go for sure. Thank you. Next questions from Bill Plunkett. Go ahead, Bill. Alex, you went uh, five weeks between uh, major league games. Was the shoulder injury more of a, more serious than we thought in the beginning? No, it, if I think that if we knew that I was going to go to the bullpen, I probably would have been back sooner. Uh, but I was ramping up uh, slowly, but ramping ramping up to to rejoin the rotation. So I that's what kind of extended it a little bit. And on a personal level, how frustrating or disappointing is it to be in this position, given your contract situation and you know how you probably looked at this year as your chance to reestablish yourself. Uh. I wouldn't, it's not, I'm not frustrated uh, in any sense of the word, to be honest, after what, what I kind of went through last year and then having the horrible timing of having some shoulder stuff crop up, you know, I, I truly, I feel healthy now. Uh, right now, I think my stuff is really good, uh, especially what I showed last night. Um, I'll be able to show plenty out of the pen down the, down the stretch. People know what I can do uh, when, when I'm healthy. And uh, I think I'll easily show that down the stretch. I'm just, I, 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 from the bottom of my heart, I came back here to win a World Series. That's why I came here. There's plenty of other places I could have gone that were safer choices for me as far as my personal future and being able to stick in the rotation. But I've invested a lot to the city of L.A., to this organization. I love these, this organization as, as much as you could, could love an organization. Uh, I'm, I'm super excited to feel good and be able to contribute in whatever way I can and hopefully get across the finish line so we can hoist a trophy up at the end of all this. Thank you. Got time for one more. Go ahead, Brooks. Hey, Alex. Uh, your velocity was notably up uh, last night. I'm assuming that's probably being 100% health. Um, but you weren't throwing, you know, 98, 100 miles an hour, but it seemed like Diamondbacks hitters were having a really hard time catching up to it. It was almost like blowing past them. Do you attribute that to your pitch mix or something in your delivery, or is it something else? Uh, my metrics were pretty good last night. Uh, and so my, my vert – uh, my movement profile was really good. Um, I think the ball is coming out. I'm clipping it really well. And so hopefully it's uh, be a nice trend moving forward and I'll be able to keep, keep doing that. But I thought the ball came out great last time. My stuff was pretty good. Uh, and again, just excited to be part of a baseball team and get to play.